Arvind, the other day we were in Oman together. Yes. And we went to visit a government research centre. Mm -hmm. And they had some strawberries growing. Yes, they had. Didn't they? Yes. And uh, the interesting thing was they had some, they had an aquaponic mm -hmm. system. And I that I think you'd help them set it up, didn't yes. you? Yes. Yes. And uh, it was a fairly simple one. It wasn't uh, anything mm -hmm. elaborate. Yeah. But they were growing beautiful strawberries mm -hmm. in there. And next door they had hydroponic strawberries. Correct. Can you tell me what happened? Well, we did a... We had to, I mean, being the enthusiasts that we are, you can't stay away from a little testing, can you? No, we can't. No. So we pulled out our refractometer yes. and we did a little BRICS index test. Yes, crushed a bit of... Strawberry, pulp, yes. uh, put it on the uh, glass of the refractometer and just set it out in the light and just take a look at what the BRICS index is. The BRICS index is, mind you, the test for how much sugar content is yeah. has actually developed inside the fruit. Yes. And uh, to give, you, give it a little reasoning, uh, Natural sugars are best formed with natural ingredients. Mm -hmm. That's that's our thesis statement, yes, if you yes, may, of yes, this yes. little experiment that we did. Yeah. And uh, lo and behold, uh, the aquaponic uh, strawberry measured 13 on the BRICS index, whereas 13. the 13, and the hydroponic uh, strawberry measured 8. 8 and 13, that's a big difference. That is a big difference. Leading up to that, mm -hmm. the guy who was in charge of the yes. centre actually said to us that the strawberries coming from the aquaponics Tasted better. Tasted better. Yes. And, and he's a hydroponic guy. He's a hydroponic so it was guy. Kind of an admission, wasn't it? It was, wasn't yeah. it? Yes, it was good. So that was exciting for me. It because, was. Um, yes. oh, and one other thing we just should clarify mm -hmm. here that you uh, told me the other day, and I've heard some people get misled by this. Mm -hmm. They try and do BRICS tests on leafy greens. Mm, yes. And they don't get very good readings. No. Now, Arvind, no. Why is that? Simply because uh, the leafy greens are sitting in water the whole time. Mm -hmm. And even in the soil, they just, they're a watery uh, mass yes. of fiber and water. They're not really sugary. They're not they? really very sugary. The sugars really forms when the flower turns into a fruit mm -hmm. or a vegetable. Mm -hmm. That's the process that converts sugars mm -hmm. or produces sugars. So you're not going to get much of a bricks reading out of leafy greens? Anymore. No, 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 not very much. Not, unless it's stevia, mm -hmm. then it's... A, that it's, might be different. That might be yeah. different, yes. So... What do you think, uh, while we're continuing this conversation, mm -hmm. what do you think about the value mm -hmm. of BRICS testing as a means of indicating nutrient value? I think it's huge. Mm -hmm. so, uh, coming back to the statement, that, the thesis statement that we made, mm -hmm. saying that natural sugars are best formed with natural ingredients. I think in the current dialogue of aquaponics versus hydroponics versus aeroponics that we're seeing in the US, mm -hmm. with the USDA coming up to terms with certifications, it's very important to understand that this BRICS index actually tells you that we're sending in plant-compatible natural ingredients into making that fruit. That sugar. Yes, that sugar. Mm. And with hydroponics, it is not happening because the ingredients are purely inorganic. And there's only three or four ingredients anyway. Yes, it's exactly. It's not a complex ingredient. No, it's not a complex ingredient. So really, it's actually a very important result, isn't it? It is. It is mm. a very, very important result yeah. if we actually think about the background yeah. to that simple 8 and 13 number. You know what? That was an amazing circumstance we mm -hmm. had, actually. It is, it is. Because how often would you have right <laughs> next door to each other yes. an aquaponic system uh -huh. and a hydroponic, um, hydroponic system. system growing the same variety of, of um, Crop, strawberries, yes. Yes. Uh, planted at the same time, mm -hmm. so we could get a really good comparison. Yes. Same greenhouse, same water, same yeah. everything, really. Same everything everything held constant. Just the aquaponics, the fish, and the uh, dosing. new dosing solution. The, yeah. That was the difference. Fantastic. Yeah. Aquaponics wins again. Again.